If you decide to put out regular video content, but you have a busy workload, it can make sense to create a batch of videos all at once when you have the time, and then drip feed them as and when they are needed. However, it turns out this strategy can backfire if you hold on to the content for too long, as we recently learned the hard way. A few months back, we brought in our friend Scott Tumulty, who, at the time, worked on a popular Geek & Sundry show to show how collaboration is a good way of increasing your online following. But in the five to six months since we shot the video, Scott has left Geek & Sundry, and we're left with a vlog that is sadly out of date. We're showing it now because we still love it, and it now also serves as a cautionary tale, in the hope that you can learn from our mistake. Nobody's perfect. Making your video stand out amongst the crowd is really important and there are a few things that you can do to avoid losing your video to the vast ocean of YouTubes. I think this is the perfect time to introduce you to a close friend of ours. He's a fellow vlogger and you may recognise him from his successful Geek & Sundry video series, Scott Tamote. Hello Stephen, thanks for asking me over. Oh, no, no, no. Thank you for joining us. So uh, what can I help you with? Well. I was just about to give an example of a way that people can make their video stand out from the crowd. And one way of doing that is with collaborative video. So... Oh, uh, oh. Well, yes, there is a lot to be said about collaborative videos. If you can find someone who has around the same number of followers or subscribers as you, then you both win. It creates an opportunity to introduce each other's fan base to each other's videos as well as encouraging them to just follow each other's channels instead of just one. Yes, but just be careful not to be taken advantage of. Try not to get involved with someone who's just using you to access your fan base if there's a so long they can't reciprocate. Yeah, I can't, can't imagine what that's like. Thanks again, Scott. Uh, we should do a production added crossover video sometime. Maybe I could come with you? Dinner? Scott? Scott! better not use my logo or any Geek & Sundry branding for this. Scott, you're still here. You've, you forgot to say like and subscribe. <laughs>